I don't remember whose idea it was, but I was just like, yeah, sure. And what, that's, that, that's a no-brainer. Uh, let's make a brandy from locally grown crepes. So, uh, so here we are. Brandy is a distilled spirit from a grape, um, sometimes other fruit, but most commonly from a grape. We're making it out of Catawba. Catawba is a grape that um, we've been very successful at Creek Pen with. It has a, this exotic, almost Hawaiian punch, watermelon kind of tropical characteristics to it. It's super flavorful. They grew them right here in Indiana at their vineyard. So these aren't brought in from anywhere else. These are estate grown grapes. This is 100% Munner County, Indiana. It's local, local. It's super local. We believe it's all about the fruit, how the fruit is grown, where it's grown, uh, how the fields are managed in the summer and harvest seasons are all uh, sort of the critical things that bear on the quality and character of that wine. There's not too many brandies made in the Midwest, and specifically not many that are made with actual estate-grown grapes. We got some grapes from Bill. They were able to start the fermentation over at Oliver. We finished the fermentation here, which is just taking the uh, raw grape juice, adding yeast and some nutrients to it, allowing it to ferment. Then we take that and pump it through our still. And then we're gonna take that, put it into barrels that have been toasted, let it wait and mature in those barrels until it's ready. I saw those for the first time today, and to, to open those up and to look inside, and to smell the, the fantastic aromas of a brandy barrel was just, it was exciting. I'm thrilled. I'm, I'm just absolutely thrilled to be involved in this, and, and I, I'm very hopeful and super high confidence that we're going to make a brandy that really just kind of, that in its peer is, you know, it's kind of its peer group, right, with great brandy is going to fit right in. Super excited. I already think we need to plant more grapes.